It's Wednesday, it's The Hump. Thanks for joining us and we are talking all things desire. <laughs> joining me this week, <laughs> we have some professionals here. Joining me this week, because they've got nowhere else to go, because no one else will have them, is Julius, Sophie Hello. and Jace. Hello, so, what's happening this week on the news? 1st of June, first day of winter, and Vivid is in full flight in Sydney. This is such a good thing for our industry. Literally a Monday night, circular key, cold, windy, and thousands, tens of thousands of people wandering around looking at lights. It's so good for the lighting and for the video industry in Australia, uh, because people are emulating it. Customers are saying, I saw this thing at Vivid, can you do it? Other cities are looking at doing it. It's a fantastic innovation. Go Sydney. So this week we're talking about desire. Mm. Now, someone's trash is someone else's treasure. This is true. You know, I, I've a bit of an eBay addict, and mm. so just in all that spare time I have, um, I'm <laughs> mad person for everything 1950s, whether I need it or not. Mm -hmm. I kind of, I'm a stalker when it comes Why to do that you kind love of the stuff. 50s? I just do. I just love all like the little canisters and retro stuff because I'm. That's still... why you love me. <laughs> no, that's not retro. That's Jurassic. But is that when you were born? <laughs> And by canisters, you mean hip flasks? Like, right? no, 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 like canisters <laughs> for the kitchen and things like oh, that. Yeah, I just love okay. like right. knickknacks and collected. Mm. Anyway, yeah. that may be weird to you, but this mm. is even more weird. People on eBay, someone spent $14,000 on buying Britney Spears used chewing gum. Oh, that is really crazy. Mm. It, like, it gets worse. Tasty. $530 on Brad Pitt and Angelina's, Angelina Jolie's breath in a jar. Mm gets worse. How do you catch that? Do you just Well, in? um <laughs> which someone caught as they walked by on a red carpet. No way. Yes. <laughs> anyway, someone was stupid That'd enough be to diluted. do that. <laughs> this is worse. Scarlett Johansson's used tissue mm. went for a whopping five thousand three hundred dollars, but the money did go that's a nice face. It did go, oh, uh, which was donated to Hunger Charity USA Harvest. Oh, okay, that's all. Um, Justin Timberlake's half-eaten French toast went for three thousand one hundred and fifty-four dollars. <laughs> but this is a great buy. This would be something that I would just love. Mm. Is a lost Charlie Chaplin film was picked up for five dollars because the buyer uh, picked up the item simply because he liked the decorative tin that it came in. Now these are great finds. Wow. But I don't know I, about the snot. I wouldn't call that a great <laughs> I mean, fun. I wouldn't anyone, pay much for no. that. But you know, horses for courses. I don't know. But see, I've got this thing where I've got too many 1950s things that I'll never use. Mm. Surely there's got to be something that you have a fancy for that you've got, oh, I've got to have it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, look, it's, it's really common in our industry. Gear acquisition syndrome. So <laughs> people go nuts. We all know a gear addict yeah. or two, or people with like 27 guitars. Yep. Um, yeah. You and you have, that. well, my husband has a man cave. And you'd think a man cave is where you do work or you do music. No. No. no, this is to, to hoard gear that he's bought without yeah. me knowing. And he's Ooh. just got microphones Ooh. and okay. so many amps. I mean, how many amps do you need? It's as ridiculous. many as pairs of shoes. Mm. Mm. But, yeah. I think there's a, there's a mathematical equation. The amount of whatever your obsession is that you should own, so whether it be bicycles or microphones or guitars, is N minus 1. And N is the amount that will make your partner leave you. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I need right. to bring this equation into my N house. N minus one. That's yeah. how many okay. you should have. Gotcha, yeah. gotcha, gotcha. See, I'm going to desire things. It's more than a, a snotty tissue from a famous person. Mm. It's going to be more like a house, you know, something that I desire. Mm. But we've got a rule. Well, I'm trying to set a rule in my house because I'm also an impulse buyer. So mm -hmm. I, I do, like it, was, it got really cold today. I'm buying a gas heater, $500. I just had to get one straight up. They're expensive, but we've got a rule that we have to sell something to buy something. Okay. That's our rule That's in our house. Yes, yeah, so if I desire something, sure, but sell something else. Yeah, mine is studio monitors. I've got a thing for studio monitors. 
Have you counted them up? No, I don't own that many. I just want to buy really, really nice ones. Oh, you desire them. Jimmy's got a pair that I covet enormously. I collect wives. (laughs) (laughs) That is an expensive habit, It is the truth. And we got rid of one to get another one. Yeah, he's he's practicing Sophie's rule, so that's probably okay. Okay. (laughs) All right, so Um, this desire. We'll be be right back up. (laughs) Metallica being from the Bay Area, especially myself, like to hook up with people who are local. Needing a smaller wedge for travel reasons, still keeping the same sonics of the giant Metallica sound was a challenge, but not for Meyer, it seems. Very pleased with uh, you know, the duties of guitar and vocals uh, coming through the same wedges, needing to have clarity in both, and this is, this is what happens with Meyer, so. The Tascam DR10SG combines both a purpose-built shotgun microphone and a professional quality digital recorder in a single unit, addressing the need for better audio when shooting on DSLR. First and foremost, the DR10SG features an extremely directional supercardioid microphone and an integrated shock-resistant mounting foot. The dual benefits of this design include the rejection of unwanted ambient sound during filming and the avoidance of physically transmitted noise from shutter or lens mechanisms. The Australian recommended retail price is $399, including GST. And welcome back to The Hump. Now, Jace, I hear you have a special report. Indeed I do, Sophie. Let's hear it. In local news, rigger Dave Ropey Brown has erected a tyre swing in his backyard for his daughter Ruby, three years old. After an initial feasibility and impact study over four months, the on-site work took three weeks and employed six staff, as well as a consulting and structural engineer. Two elevated work platforms were brought into Dave's backyard for the job, and the swing is held up by four digitally controlled laser-steered chain motors with double braking and a 10 to 1 safety factor. When contacted for comment, daughter Ruby said, "Wee." Did they do an environmental impact study no. to check that the magpies in or the partridge in the pear tree? <laughs> they didn't think this through. Wasn't yeah, impacted. well, I don't think this has been done properly, really. I think Dave should probably end up in a court of law, really. Absolutely. It's just not safe. Won't someone think of the children? He does not care for his children. No, no, and the partridge. Yeah, indeed, indeed. Anyway, let's have a look at what's in Gearbox. Okay. <laughs> Jason, DB Technologies ES503. Yeah, that's what we're standing in front of here. Look, there seems to be a lot of manufacturers falling over themselves to make small, portable sort of corporate gigs stick it in a corner, two or three box systems, you know, easy load in, easy setup. Um, It can be a little bit of an uninspiring marketplace, I think. They're all kind of plastic, they're all kind of light, they're all kind of cheap, um, and with similar acoustic results. This one's a wooden sub. Yeah, that's that's not bad. The sub's actually not bad at all. Mm. Integrated uh, amp DSP. So there's three channels. Uh, You can actually, so you can run in stereo with the top boxes or in mono as an array. It's also got an aux output, it's got a mic input, a line input, and Bluetooth connect- connectivity. That's it for another fun-filled, adventure-filled, wonderful time with this mad lot. You may go back onto the streets. <laughs> Thank you. We'll see you next week. Bye. Bye.